Welcome everybody, I'm Joshino and today I'm just going to do a quick tutorial on how to get Paladin's Public Test on Steam. Now I have done another video about the normal version, how to get it. They're both extremely simple, but a lot of people ask in my comment section on how to get it. So if you want to see the other version, if you're not using Steam, then it'll be in the cards above. So today I'm just going to quickly show you how to do it. So you click onto pa your Paladin's installation, this is probably the quickest way. Go to the right here and go to store page and scroll down and it's here below the early access symbol there's a notice want to participate in paladin's public tests question mark click here to install it now which you do and then it'll give you an option are you sure you want to install paladin's public test server and here you go you can have it it's basically the public test po ownership is ticked you'll download it and basically this will update as soon as the update goes live for the pts it's been pretty much on par with the non-Steam version and it's been pretty epic because it just does it automatically. So another question that everybody asks is how often is the PTS up? Why is the PTS down? So the PTS, the public test server, will only go up after the patch preview. So it's usually on the Friday, which the last Friday was the... Wait, let's have a look what the date was. The date for the last patch preview was the 4th, the Friday the 4th, and the the PTS, the public test server, goes live usually on the same night as the patch preview, depending on your time zone. Sometimes it's on the next day, uh, in the next morning, especially for Europe, if it, there's some problems. And that will stay live probably until sort of roughly the Tuesday or the Wednesday the next week. So it's not very long that it stays up. So you've got to bear that in mind. It's not, um, it's not up very long at all. All you do is you log in with all of your normal information, which is fine. You come into the game, and well, actually, I've got a problem because I was doing some data mining, so I touched some of the files. But that, that you don't need to worry about that. That's going to happen to you. It should just launch as per usual. So one good thing about the PTS is that you'll have pretty much unlimited crystals. It restocks every time you log in, so you can basically buy absolutely everything in the patch. So I've got all of the skins from OB56, which is our latest patch and you can try them out yourself with no hassle unless you have to unlock them like the Konoichi skin for Sky. Anyway now we've got <laughs> anyway now I've got a exclamation mark PTS code for Twitch and other stuff and yeah it's it literally is as simple you just click on the button and install it so I hope everybody's helped out by this if they didn't know how to install the PTS and if not, then, well, it's so easy, so you may as well try it. But remember, it's only usually from every two weeks, so the bi-weekly patches, from the 4th. So the next one will probably be on, like, the 18th. And it only lasts for about four or five days. So you're not going to have long to play it. But if you do want to try it out, then give it a download. I'll be streaming later, and we'll probably be playing some PTS and doing some custom games for subscribers, so... Might want to try and download it for that. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, subscribe for more of my content, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching. Joshino.